Ann Wiley of Gwinnett County, Georgia, says that a series of bank errors landed her accounts $300 million in the red. And told WSB-TV Channel 2 Action News. First half started realizing uh, that I was having problems yesterday when I was trying to pay a bill online and kept getting error messages or denied. Later, she had problems paying at a gas pump, so Ann decided to check her bank account on her phone. Let's take a look at this bank statement. 1076, normal, 399, normal, 105, normal, 1, normal, 425, normal, 99,999,999, normal, 3271, normal, 100, normal. I don't see the error, or wait a second. That charge for 99,999,999 does look off compared to the rest of the numbers. The surprised account holder went home to double check the debit on her home computer and found another deduction listed. Yes, 100 million from my savings and 100 million from my checking. Overnight, the situation got even worse. I wake up the next morning, check again, maybe this is a bad dream. There's another 100 million, so. $300 million I'm having a problem with right now. If only bank errors were more like they were in Monopoly. In that game, bank errors get you rewarded a cool $200. In real life, bank errors result in you being told you're $300 million in debt. Ann reported the issue to SunTrust Bank, who told her that the problem was with the Georgia Department of Revenue. SunTrust and the DOR are working together to investigate the issue. It's believed that the problem could be traced to a used car that Ann bought in 2004, which had a remaining balance of $274.62 for the sales tax. How that sales tax amount ballooned to a $300 million debt is the question. Anne currently has tens of millions of dollars in pending credits, which hopefully will bring her accounts back up to zero during the continuing investigation. While the DOR cannot comment on individual taxpayers, they say they have no documents showing that they are in the wrong. Well, if it's not their fault, and it's not SunTrust's fault, and it's not Anne's fault, I guess it can't be anybody's fault. Whoops. Sorry, Ann, you're not allowed to access your money at all because you were just one of those unlucky types that accidentally gets stuck with a bill of $300 million. Come on! This is stupid. I'm mad. I bet Ann is mad too. I can't even get really mad at it because it's like I'm, I'm thinking, okay, Ann, any minute now somebody's going to realize this and, and fix it. It's, it's a huge mistake. It's got to be. Wow. Talk about grace under pressure.